now. I'm going for the win, I got a lot to lose. I'm independent with the pen, I got nothing to prove. You could sit back, chill, just listen and groove. But the mission be sedition, who be up in the mood? Point missing, politician need to get up and move. See a whole fucking nation, corporation approved. Segregation, domination, degradation approved. All this hate and devastation, cop station approved. So I'm saying to you, if a god do exist, why he do what he do? And who got control, who be making the moves? Amazon, Philippines, Mother Nature, we lose. She exploited like a worker, left battered and bruised. By this big money biz, severely abused. But who to accuse, and who to excuse? If you wanna see change, you could change your views. Propaganda and news, you could see what you choose. Obama, Trayvon, forget about napalm. Dropping the A-bomb, it's hard to stay calm. Obvious day wrong, the commoner's faith gone. No common kamikaze, not common to put your body in front of a with shotties, no dreams of Maseratis, no life from the paparazzi, that life I cannot embody, my life will not be a copy, you see a storm brewing, the water getting choppy, but I coast on this flow, motherfucker try to stop me, militarized cops getting sloppy, caught taking swings, big poppy, but we gon' roll it up like a maki, no problem if my eyes get glossy, I'm hot in the kitchen feeling cocky, and fuck anyone who getting bossy, my boss out in Boston used to cut my pay, by more than a goddamn hour each day, while the spot got a menu in the top pay grade for some rich motherfucker drop a hundred on a plate I've worked long weeks maybe eight days straight seen the city locked down show the police state I'm a pro heavyweight high heaven elevate turn lemon lemon lemonade diabetes sugar craze I kill a beat twist the haze I've been blazed since my teenage and I'm leaving haters phased or amazed in Boston, Massachusetts was my first protest and it was amazing. Me and my teachers met amazing people and were inspired by the courage shown to fight against gun violence. I'm only 11 and I don't want to hide in the closet. Imagine the nightmare of going to prison for a crime you did not commit. Losing your freedom, being torn from your family. This should not happen, but unfortunately it does. That's why the New England Innocence Project exists. To free innocent men and women, to bring them home to their loved ones, we work so that this nightmare does not happen to anyone else. Three, two, one. Be in plastic box. Because she could not afford it, but she still owes me 25 cents from the UPS stamp. But Papa, wait, can you what? Can you wait? <laughs> wait. Shake up a lot of your ideas about washing clothes. Now it's like 
into the money. Check your money. Check your time. Check yourself. Let's drive on.
the show here we are at Papa can you wink um we actually have no friends or associates that have birthdays in the month of July um including America you know I'm not an ally but we do believe in independence and um we did have an activist show up at our show um he was asking certain questions, making certain statements. One of those statements was that Papa cannot wink. Excuse me, we can't hear you. We're on live television. That's not true. I heard he could wink a real good. It just that sometimes when he, people put pressure on him, you know, he can't win. Who's he? He, Tyrone, Papa, Jones, the man, the legend, I mean, wherever he, you know. I heard he can win pretty good, especially when Who's he, that? It is I. It is me. I can't wink. And I'm not ashamed to say it, okay? I mean, that's what you want me to say. No, actually, I really didn't want you to say that. I mean, I had to admit it. We're getting calls <laughs> from I mean, a lot of our sponsors right now. The boards I are mean, lighting up. That's what he said, but I feel like I can't. Okay, anyways, we looked into this activist that came on our show, and we found some of the other things that he is active about in the community, and we are deciding to play that to... um. I wouldn't say honor. Is there anyone that, who did not sign up for public comment gonna, that would? Just gonna, um, is there any? We're just gonna segue out of the current disaster into this. <laughs> anyone who did not sign up for public comment that would wish to speak, please come up to the mic. State name, address, and the issue you're speaking on, please. Uh, good afternoon. How's it going? Uh, my name is Herb Morsiglo, uh, Sydney Street. Um, can you can you say that a little slower for the clerks, oh, please? I'm so sorry. <laughs> How's it going? Um, my name is Herb Morsiglo, Mayor McGovern, City Council. How's it going today? Um, City of Cambridge, I see what's going on, and I just want to congratulate you guys, man. The um, City of Cambridge has been too colorful and too loud for way too long. You know, um, this evicting everybody from WMF, I mean from the EMF is, uh, is a big victory for us. We could uh, take it a little bit further. I say we start painting everything gray, just one color of gray. And then afterwards, we should start, um, oh, we should make it so that after 7 p.m., anyone that uh, plays the instrument should pay a fine. But the fine should be paid to, not to the city, 
but to private contractors because, you know, they are our ruling class, I guess. Thank you very much. Have a good day. Yeah, I mean, that was, that's brilliant right there. That's, that's, that's the truth, and that's how he feels, you know. I mean, Cambridge, man, that's, you know, that's why I call it, it's a shame bridge sometimes, but, you know, that's how it is, though. We gonna, um... I say it's a great bridge, and I support it, and I support what this young man sees. I think it's the truth, and I think that it's great. Yeah, me too. Props, man. That was you the real MVP. And, um, it takes an MVP to know who's the MVP. So. I salute you, my man. That's the signal. Yes, it's right for this next segment. We will be doing the makeover challenge while you two tell me um, a dream something in a dream that you've had either once or recurringly and i will look it up in my thousand dream interpretations okay, here t now. will you do johnny's makeup please okay, sure. and Thank tell you, and 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 tell me um one of the themes of one of your dreams Just go right up to the left. Do you dream, T? I mean, isn't life just a dream? But yeah. <laughs> but not like really though. Like, we have really. a caller. Hello, caller. We have a caller. Hello, caller. You got it. Can you hear us, caller? Well, thank you for calling. <laughs> And please call again. Okay. What is one of your dreams that you've had, T? Um, I had um that I was a funny, successful comedian, um, playing in a sold-out packed house that everybody loved me, and every joke I said landed, and it was like the best drug. That I have a hand, and that's not too much, <laughs> except for that day. <laughs> Which I care to talk, care talked about, but um, it was a great dream, and you know, it made me, made me want to get better at, at my, you know, what my thing and my craft, you know, because um, that's the goal is to be a legend. When it's You're doing all. a good job, Tim. Except, but, um, okay, except for that day. What are you talking about? I said it was the best drug I ever did, except for that day when, you know, I was fucked up off of. And on my birthday, I did some, you know, some drugs. Hey, I'm just trying to be brave here, but um, it was it was not cool. Drugs are not my friend. I support you, man. I get you back. Okay. Well, I mean, you know, what kind of drugs? Yeah. It was um, edibles. Oh, yeah. Yeah. But, um. Let's not focus on that. Like I said, it was like yeah. the well, drug, because comedy, like the adrenaline is so, you know, it's like a drug. And like I said, that I had this dream when yeah. I was like... I only asked so I could give you even yeah. deeper support. In a packed right. house, and the, the, that was so, it was a good dream. It was a good, better, best drug that I ever known in the comedy. George, do you have anything in the book about it? Um, yes, we do have comedy here listed in my dream interpretations. 10,000 dreams interpreted. Interpreted. <laughs> this is what you've done to me. A dictionary of dreams. To dream comedy. To dream of being at a light play denotes that foolish and short lived pleasures will be indulged in by the dreamer. Sounds right to me. Mm -hmm. To dream of seeing a comedy is significant of light pleasures and pleasant tasks. But that was. Do you want to hear what comic songs means? Yeah. To hear comic songs for, oh wait, hold on. Okay. To hear comic songs and dreams foretells that you will disregard an opportunity to advance your affair, affairs 
and enjoy the companionship of the pleasure loving. To sing one proves that you will enjoy much pleasure for a time, but difficulties will overtake you. Cool, cool. I heard that, I mean, any dreams you had that you want to do quickly before we get into a um, S-O-N-G? Let's have... Hmm. Got a couple of SLNGs we gotta do. SLNG songs. Who? With an E, with an S. I told you I never make that sound. Okay. You're right. True, true. Right. Hmm. Okay. Did you leave your mojo at the bank today? Mojo is here, and we're gonna do. Speaking of you Mojo, makeover. No, we can't do. No, oh, we can do like no. First. Okay. You, um, Johnny, do you want to make Tyrone over? Yeah. Well, whilst you tell him, you tell me, me a dream that you yeah. had mm -hmm. with a significant. The thing is that I'm gonna. I can only look up the word of something that you've. That you know, like, sure. it's got to be a thing. It can't be like a fake dream about no. you being a comedian that was never a dream is just what you want to no, say. No, an actual it dream. Was. Yeah, an actual an dream. An actual would be dream preferred. that I had recently, uh, oh. I have the most vivid memories of. Oh, wow. Is, uh, you turn this way before, oh, the other way. Was I was, uh, I work in Back Bay and I was walking home like I always do along Mass Ave over the Mass Ave Bridge. And I made it just before the bridge and the International Space Station and the Space Shuttle we're flying overhead in a circular pattern in slow motion and they collided and they both crashed down into Back Bay and then uh, Mass Ave turned into a river that was filled with people and I, I made it down to Mass Ave and it was a river and I began to try to uh, navigate in the river so I could get back to Cambridge and that's when I woke up. Cool, cool, that sounds it, great, it, man. I it, wish I was there. I couldn't believe it, man. The ship was in slow motion, going in a circular pattern, perfectly over Back Bay. Uh, what, a helicopter? Uh, it was the International Space Station and the Space Shuttle. Okay. So... You turn this way toward me, oh thing. Oh, my God. Okay. Spaceships, basically. Yeah, you got spaceships, yeah. Spaceships and um, okay. river, I think. Yeah. There are things okay. I can look up there, okay? Mm -hmm. River. Yep. If you see a clear, smooth, flowing river in your dream, you will soon succeed to the enjoyment of delightful pleasures, and prosperity will bear flattering promises. If the waters are muddy or tumultuous, there will be disagreeable and jealous contentions in your life. If you are water-bound by the overflowing of a river, there will be temporary embarrassments in your business, or you will suffer uneasiness lest some private escapade will reach public notice and cause your reputation harsh criticisms. If, while sailing upon a clear river, you see corpses in the bottom, you will find that trouble and gloom will follow swiftly upon present pleasures and fortune. To see empty rivers denotes sickness and unusual ill luck. Well, a lot of that was true. Um... I feel that the river in your dream was a positive it, river, I want to say. Yes, well, there was the no corpse. It was flowing. It was, flowing it, was, and... it was a flow. Yeah. It was a flow. Yeah, I got distracted well. with the corpses, but the corpses wasn't true. But whatever positive things that were said at the beginning was true. But I, I, I wish I remembered. Space aliens. Space. To dream of traveling in outer space means that you will soon be freeing yourself from a confining situation you'll experience a newfound sense of independence and freedom. Let's see if they have rocket ship. That sounds pretty good. I'd, uh, I wouldn't mind stopping right there. Yeah, exactly. We have two and a half minutes left. And... Well, let's, let's do a birthday, innocent. Thanks for the makeup. Uh, I look good, Papa, thank you. Ooh, I like what you've done here. Yeah. Um, I, I flattered his, his features. Oh, I don't know can, can you get in? You are fun, that's right. Some people stay far away from the door. 
If there's a chance of it opening up Making up for the love you've been denying. 